where is it going to stop? Mark Speaker and others in Lavalette have a clear message for Verizon. We don't want more. More small cell sites on utility poles. Lavalette has nine throughout town. This month, borough leaders rejected a proposal from the communications giant to put up about a half a dozen additional sites for 5G and 4G signals on new and existing poles. Seems like there's a density occurring here that we're not seeing everywhere else, and we, we wanted to know why, and we were not provided with satisfactory answers to those questions. Verizon would not speak to density, citing competitive information. Despite previous objections, the existing sites ultimately went up. Verizon has faced similar pushback in other shore communities and beyond. Some concerns involve how the small cell equipment looks and its potential impact on public health. I'm very nervous. I live here year round. Verizon points to international scientific research indicating radio frequency energy from wireless devices and networks have not been shown to cause health problems. The company would not comment on Lavalette rejecting its latest plan. In general, it says the equipment could be added to a particular area to handle more users utilizing their wireless devices for more things. This is a proliferation now. We started out with a few and now they're just growing like weeds. Previously, officials say unknown legal costs prevented Lavalette from moving forward with a court battle. But they say in this round, they're prepared for a fight if needed. Now that we see other communities pushing back, hopefully we'll be able to form some kind of a coalition that will be able to take them on. Opposition that could lead to waves of legal interference. Ted Greenberg, NBC 10 News.